Hello everybody, Keith Henry here at the Morgan State Legacy track meet with the one and only head coach of Coppin State University track and field, Carl Hicks. Coach Hicks, um, we, had, we had quite the day today, didn't we? And I know we have to start, we, you know where we have to start. Your, for, your former um, Coppinite Joseph Amoa doing serious world altering damage in that 100 meter dash. Yes, um, it's amazing. You know, very, very few people in the world can do what he did, break 10 seconds in the 100 meter dash. And we were fortunate to witness that today live. And uh, it was an outstanding moment for everyone and uh, an exciting moment for everyone for my team and an exciting moment for all the fans that came out to support the track meet today. Coach, um, and, the, and even with Joseph Manu, that was, that was his, I don't know if that's his season high with wind, without, yeah, without the wind. That's his season best with, with wind, so that moves him up on the top 48 list for the NCAA regionals, and I hope now that we can get a little bit more faster and have to carry us to the NCAA championship. Um, on on the women's side, Coach, uh, Latifah Ali continues to do damage. Latifah Ali is, is a special person, man. She's a hard worker, man. She's a determined young lady. She's determined to be one of the best. She's determined to get to the NCAA. Um, with, uh, and we hope that you know she continues on her success, and um, and I hope the team can carry carry on. And even both 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 your um, four by fours, one 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 today. Yeah, we had a little tune up pin relays is coming up next weekend, and we will see how fast that we can run. Um, you know, against ourselves running for time and, and then also to, to get ready for this weekend for some, some great bump and some great uh, competition coming up in the pin relays. Um, long, and even we got a long, long jump, a tie, tie for the top, look like for the day. Yeah, look. he actually won the long jump, yeah. I believe. And um, and and I placed him in the top 48 in, in, uh, for, the, for the NCAA Regional East and we hope that we can get him the NCAA championship in due time. Coach, um, what does this team need to learn for these next few weeks? These next few weeks aren't going to be easy, but it's... Yeah, what well, they got to learn, um, you got to run a certain amount of events and a certain limited amount of time. You know, schedule's going to be really tight, so we got about an hour recovery in between your your open race and the relay. Um, we're a very small team, so that's, that's what we're working on right now. So some guys did like four events a day. Some people did three. Um, and and sometimes that's what we have to we work on to get ourselves in race shape to do to do to the weather that, that prohibited us from doing these type of things. Now we got a little break in the weather and we, and we took advantage of it today. All right, coach, thanks so much. Thank you so much, Mr. Henry. I appreciate you. Go Eagles.